let me then mention them last but not least uh, our tribute to the Tibur, done by Joshua Solas. So Kings and Creative was kind enough to have a, have a, a small open call for this first mural that the, the prompt was to, you know, um, paint a mural that was in honor of, of, the, of the, the reggae great. And um, the design I came up with was um, what you see here, which is something that captures its lightness, kind of gives uh, that bright energy that he always had in his inner, um, you know, it's super, you know, energetic performances and that kind of thing. So I was trying to capture all that, but also um, really make mention or highlight his legacy. So throughout the mural, you can see that section on, this, on the, the left side is articles from the Gleano. Um, so shout out to the Gleano. <laughs> <laughs> what was it like painting it? I mean, a lot of people are talking about the community. I know it was really nice to come down there. Yeah, it was, nice you know, the, the community has been very welcoming to us, inspiring. Um, you know, we have no issues painting. I mean, the process of the painting took a bit longer than we expected because we had some water damage issues. How long did it take you guys? So it was supposed to be 10 days, but it took about three and a half weeks. Um, you know, we had to scrape, like maybe about 80% in, we had to scrape off and paint over. Wow. So, all of what you see here is new, is, is fresh. Fresh, yeah. fresh after. It, so. it, it works yeah. it. We're, we're happy with it, you know. Um, Some things were done a lot better the second time around. How was it for you? Honestly, uh, I hadn't painted in a really long time. Because as you know, like, I focus a lot on the designing and the costume making. And, you know, COVID has been a bit interesting in terms of really... You, you look at it as Wonder is shut, but it's really... Yes, Wonder is shut, but then other things are open. So I decided to walk through this door because I was highly invited. <laughs> and, you know, it, it turned out to be a beautiful experience and it definitely brought me back to a lot of things that I used to be interested in and it, it's pushing me to want to perfect a lot more things that I hadn't focused on. Okay, nice. What, what's your favorite Toot song, right? Well, I think mine would be... Um, Pressure Drop. Pressure Drop. I like um, Bucky Kingston, you know. I like Bam Bam. I for more reasons than the song itself. <laughs>